Andrew Pike's first automated robot, K456, that was developed in 1964. And we're using this as kind of the genesis of the exhibition because it really shows his initial interest in using the body in his sculptures and his interest in using technology to create his visual artworks. We come up to the mid-80s where he returns back to the idea of creating robots and thinking about the body and technology. This series showed the family, the mother, father, baby, grandmother, grandfather, aunt and uncle. Nam Jun Paik's uh, rendition or his interpretation was much more benign and really echoed his um, experiences growing up in a very traditional Korean family unit. The kind of vintages of the consoles that he's using um, allude to their age. Through this use of material, the artist is not only charting the relationship generationally between these characters, but also charting the evolution of technology through the generations. This work here is uh, called Golden Buddha from 2005, and it's towards the latter part of the artist's life. He passed away in 2006. It is also very humorous because this Buddha kind of plays on this irreverent attitude that the artist had throughout his practice. This installation, Free Camera Participation, Participation TV from 1969, ends the exhibition. And I really wanted to include an interactive installation to really kind of underscore the collaborative spirit um, and inclusiveness that the artist had with his audience. Nam Jun Paik has a really great legacy and a long-standing legacy. You know, as a pioneer in the video medium, he really kind of laid the groundwork for subsequent generations of artists to really have the opportunity to create works.